Hello everyone, welcome to Claymakes. In this video, we're gonna be making another massive Minecraft diorama that's going to link in with the other one from last week, complete with all the nether creatures that we've made so far, and giant light up lava pits. Let's jump into it. Hey guys, welcome back to another Minecraft diorama. Last time we used these one inch by one inch wooden cubes that I had to cut a million of, but the measurement was not quite an inch. So I had a lot of like cut off stuff and fiddly work I had to do. So this time we're gonna use the actual template that I used for the last one and take the measurements off of this. Let's get going. So first, like with the last diorama, I just started out with a cardboard base. And then here you'll see me just drawing out a basic template, like where all the lava pits are going to go, where all the levels are going to go, and so on. Let's time lapse this. We're back in the garage again and now that we have the basic diorama all set up and ready to go now we gotta basically just rigid the whole thing up so it actually can be stacked with the other diorama that we made a few weeks ago i'm just gonna run some more of the scraps around the edges here and we'll run some lines underneath just again to strengthen it all up let's do it So here you can see I'm just using hot glue and these are the little ridges of the wood that I was talking about. I did this on the last diorama to, and it gave it a lot of rigidity and strength and this way it allowed me to have the other one stack on top of this one. Now that this thing is all nice and sturdy, now we can turn to the lava pits. We're just gonna be using these basic acrylic sheets and we're gonna show you a really simple but effective trick to get all these complex shapes that we need for this lava. It involves tape, let's do it. So for the trick with this is just to lay down a bunch of strips. Make sure you overlap, be generous with the amount of overlap because the more you overlap, the easier it is to basically cut out the template later which is what we're going to do right here then we're going to take this template and just basically just stick it down to the acrylic trace it out and it will match up perfectly so now after printing out about 20 sheets of the nether rack texture that i needed i'm just going to cut it out and spend the next four hours gluing all this on as well time lapse it
And then for the lava pits, I just took a, just a basic orange paint and just did one thin even coat over the whole thing so that the LED strips that I place underneath will give it a nice glow. Then I just added in all the nether characters that we've done so far, like the zombie pigmen, the blaze, and the last video was the guest. We're gonna be adding on all the characters for the nether and also updating this one with the new forest and the biomes for the new Minecraft. And here you'll see that I took the older diorama that we did a few weeks ago and I stacked it right on top and those pillars there that double as like an archway and everything like that help to actually support the diorama on top. Remember, if you like the video and you want to see more, make sure you smash the subscribe button down below. If you want to check out more of my videos, click or tap right over here. Remember to hit that like or dislike button and comment down below and I'll see you all next week.